Okay, it is Mega here. I've got a little project today. So, uh, so I've had these, uh, these planks here, or ramps, that I made a long time ago, and they've served me well. Um, it's basically a, I think it's a 2x8. Yeah, it's a 2x8. And, uh, and then it has these little ramparts. It's made by ramparts. It's like their little ramp ends to it, and you bolt them onto the bottom. So like uh, it it clamps better to the to the the side of the trailer. So, but uh, I always wanted like uh, I always wanted a way to put these on the trailer. You know, some some uh, I think some uh, some trailers have a little pocket to slide the the ramps underneath. You know. The, tra the trailer. I thought that was pretty slick, but I don't have anything like that. I suppose I could fabricate something like that, but uh, uh, one what I wound up doing most of the time is either uh, oh yeah yeah actually this is what I'm using right now. I actually use this right now. So I mean, and it works okay, but um, there has to be a better one. Like it flops. What I don't like about this is it flops around a lot. Um, so. So this goes on there like that on the E-Tracks, and then I lock it in the pin. There's a hole drilled here, and I stick it in the pocket here, and then it just stays on the trailer. But the problem is like it flops around a little bit, um, and there's no way I can put one on the other end because it's got that ramp end onto it. And then I wind up, and since it flops around, I wind up like uh, um, bungee cording it to my motorcycle or something, so that's kind of annoying. That's the only way I can get it on the trailer. Uh, or I wind up throwing it in the van. I know, hey, Zamega, why don't you just buy some folding ramps, damn it? <laughs> but uh, uh, maybe I will. But uh, well, I saw on the internet that there is a uh, that some dude he made a he he had some ramps similar to these, but uh, he he made stake sides on it. He puts um, these. See, there's these stake pockets here to put like the sides on it on the trailer. So. Uh, and what I'm gonna do is, um, I already have something like that already, right here. So you see, these are the, these are the kind of like, it's like a fence of some sort to put on the side of the trailer, so your stuff doesn't fall out. <laughs> um, and and it's great, it works okay. Um, but I thought like, hey, well, why don't I just, so what I'm, uh, why don't I just put the ramps on that, you know? So what I'm gonna do is exactly that. Uh, what we're gonna do is uh well you know I never thought about that yeah there's a couple ways I can do this but we'll see what works um, uh, so a two by four fits in there so the two by four is gonna stick out and then I'm gonna bolt the um, we're gonna bolt the ramp to the two by four so that's why I have my ramps here and a, and a two by four here and then so I just have to figure out I have to set the right height I don't want it really tall so it doesn't flop around too much you know but I don't want it uber low also so uh, yes so I, I, at the very least I want it to clear yeah it has at the very least the ramp has to clear the fender so I, I figure I'm gonna go for six inches six inches off the deck um, for I for the for the lowest part of the ramp so that is that is the, the goal today so I just thought about it like if I could uh, if I can just bolt it on to the, um, the stake, a 2x4, or I can just bolt it on permanently. Um, I'm gonna, I'm kind of throwing up the idea of uh, bolting it on permanently. So when I, when, um, when I want to take the ramp out, I just pull this pin out and then just take the whole ramp out and then I put it back in. Uh, I put it on top here and then, uh, so that that's that's probably what I'm gonna wind up doing, or I can make it so like I can pull I can yeah I, I could do that too. I could probably just put this so uh, yeah it'd be kind of more work. Just four pins though. Um, I'm planning to put two pins or two bolts on each one just like this to this. So and it should be plenty strong. These ramps are are uber strong. I've had these for a long time and they've never let me down. You can see they're. They're pretty beat up already, but they work pretty good. It's not like I'm carrying a lot of super heavy stuff with it, but yeah. Sometimes I use it to load stuff into my van too, so. 
Um, but yeah, so so that's the idea. Uh, so here I have. Um, I I, I kind of messed up. I only bought four of each. So actually, I realized oh I need eight because I need four for each side. So so it's gonna be two here and like two here and then um, so that's gonna be four. And then I got these kind of these are carriage bolts similar to this, so it's nice and flush and. Uh, and some lucky nuts and some washers so and I think that should do the trick right there um, these these ramps are a little bit on the heavy side so yeah I, I probably want to keep them as low as possible and like if I wanted to put like the I still have those so if I still wanted to put something else on it then I could you know. so and then another thing is I have to uh, I have to bolt the stake on so uh, so I can load my quad um, so yeah, so I think, yeah, so what I'm going to wind up doing is have one coming out this way and one coming out the other way and then, and then um, when I put it on, the stakes are going to, when I put it on the edge of the ramp, the stakes are going to be sticking out each side. Let's just be okay, I think. Oh yeah, it would make kind of loading, it would make kind of loading harder because you'd have to step over the stakes. Yeah. No, we'll figure something out. <laughs> we only need one to load a motorcycle, so um, yeah. Because uh, on the motorcycle, you when you're loading it, you can walk. You want to walk alongside the ramp, sort of, kind of, and that's kind of hard to do if there's two pieces of wood sticking out of it. So we'll see. All right, so it's all right. The first thing to do is to uh, measure how much wood I need, um, and then uh, yeah. So this is some piece of two by four that I've had lying around for a while. And it, you can tell it's pretty dirty, so I'm gonna, I'll probably cut them and then I'll clean them, I'll wash them, and then uh, I'm gonna paint it blue, like, uh, like my ramps, because my van is blue. <laughs> this, this is the van that hauls this trailer. Uh, well, most of it is battleship gray, but uh, um, the rest of it will be blue. So, all right, well, I'll show you what I come up with. <laughs> all right, here's the.